All right, guys, Splits here. I'm gonna show you how to connect your PS4 controller to PC so you can actually play GTA 5 with it. And this is working right now, so if I actually break right now, if I look left, right? So yeah, this is working. And the good thing about this is that you don't need to download anything. It's all done within Steam, and it's actually quick and easy to do and set up. And just real quick, I really wanna try to get this video to at least 101 likes. I know it's a lot, but I really need it, so yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so my controller is completely off right now. And before we connect it, you just want to open up Steam. And if you look at the top right, you'll see this big picture mode. That's where you want to go, so just click on it. Okay, so this is what big picture mode looks like. So you just want to go to the settings, and then controller settings, and then this is what you want checked. So. PlayStation configuration support, so check that. And then this is the part where you want to connect your controller, so I'm going to do that right now. All right, so it's connected. Just give it a sec. And then here it is. It automatically found my PS4 controller. So now we can go back. You may notice when you plugged in your controller, like you won't hear a sound coming from your headphones. This happens to you. It's an easy fix. So just go to this power symbol right here and then minimize big picture. Go on the bottom right where you see the volume. Right click, open sound settings, and then just pick whichever headphones that you're using. Mine's actually this one right here. So now we can go back. So now you can hear the menu sound and the game audio. So everything is basically set up. I'm gonna start up GTA 5 and show you that the PS4 controller is now gonna work. So let's do it. So here it is, using the PS4 controller on PC to play GTA 5. So if I go right and then left, yeah, I can see it is working. So just real quick, if you actually go to the settings and then gamepad, this is where you can customize like your sensitivity and stuff. So it's up to you how you want it. And yeah, that's basically it. That's how you do it. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe. This helps you out. And yeah.